Hey guys, what's up? I'm Daniel Mesco. And before this video gets started, I just want to say that I hope you guys enjoy the new name change. And the reason why I changed it is because, well, it's easier for people to find it. Because <laughs> I went to a meeting the other day and people were asking me, oh, what's your YouTube channel called? And it's kind of hard to say, oh, Daniel Mesco. And they're like, how do you spell Mesco? You only know how to spell it unless I tell you or you see it on paper. Or you're really, really hella smart and you find it out. So, yeah. And it makes much more sense because my Facebook and Twitter are both iPhone 411. So, now they're, you know, 3 out of 3. So anyway, let's get on with the video, guys. Hope you enjoy. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Daniel Mesco. Welcome to a brand new video. And today we're going to talk about physical appearance or in other words should we should blind people dress up because well i came across this topic a few days ago on facebook on a facebook group called the blind community and somebody posed a question saying why should we blind people dress up you know we can't see so why should we pretend we're sighted and well it all comes down to this are you going to want to talk to someone who sounds horrible or you know someone who sounds horrible someone who has a horrible demeanor and someone who has bad breath no right i wouldn't you get away from me but anyway just like that you're gonna want someone who comes across nice who looks nice who acts nice who smells good and you know just like that you're gonna want to talk to someone who is approachable not that psychopath who with messed up hair and tattered clothes and whatever anyway you're not gonna want to talk to those kind of people and so goes for you know when you're gonna go meet when you're gonna go meet a significant other and her parents like when I went when I went to go visit Nicole for the first time um, I went dressed all nice I'm pretty sure her, they wouldn't agree if I would have worn you know my uh, sweater and jeans or you know a uh, wife beater or <laughs> wife beater bad joke um, uh, muscle shirt and some shorts or whatever looking like i just got back from the gym or something and they would have been like is that seriously what you're into or is that seriously what you want to who you want to spend your life with or you know when you have a job interview you're gonna want to dress nice you're gonna want to wear something presentable because you want them to you want them not to look at you from the outside if you dress horrible they're gonna that's all they're gonna see they're not going to hear what you have to say. They're not going to hear what what you have to offer. They're going to be like, oh my God, did you see that person who came in looking like they just came out of an accident? You know, with stains all over their shirt and whatnot. And it's kind of sad that, you know, some blind people have that mentality. But you have to, come on guys, you have to get over it. I, came, I come from both sides of the spectrum. I was able to see before and now I can't. And seven years later, almost that I've been blind I've been told that I dress nice I don't like not color coordinating just because I think it looks stereotypical there's a lot of stereotypes for blind people that you know they wear things that don't match they wear things that you know they dress kind of weird and I don't want to be that kind of person I don't want to be that kind of blind person I refuse to be that kind of blind person that's why I have a color identifier um, or I ask people what color is this what color is that or if I'm gonna go to a nice event I don't want to be the dude that you know everyone's dressed on nice and here I come rolling up with my baggy jeans and my long shirts or whatever and you know I ask people what's what's this, what's the dress code so you know so many people have to just get over it that's just a fact it's gonna be like that we live in a sighted world and that's just the way things are there's more sighted people other than blind people i would hate to be in a world of blind people i would but that's just the way it is um so if you guys have a question or if you guys want me to answer questions on these blog videos uh send them my way help iphone 411 at gmail.com not only do i do tech videos i also do black videos i haven't been doing them for a while but i want to stick i want to you know get that started up again so if you guys have any questions send them my way if you guys have an opinion about this uh leave your comment down below and well yeah i'll see you guys next weekend or actually next weekend what am i talking about next wednesday with a brand new video and don't forget to follow me on facebook and twitter and subscribe if you haven't already all right guys take care bye